Hello and welcome to your new job, Doug's and Rachel's. We have the best animatronics and food available at the lowest prices. Straight up guarantee. Since this is your first night at the job, we'll connect you to a live call with our colleague. He'll be your guide for the first night. Have fun. Huh. Uh, hello? Hello, hello? Are you there? Uh, hi! Uh, you must be the new night guard. Well, uh, if that's the case, which it probably is, then I'm supposed to help you with our amazing technology. It's a bit, uh, it's a bit cheesy, but you get the point, right? Well, for starters, the company thinks that putting up security cameras in practically any corner is going to help. And honestly, I don't think it will, with what you're going to have to deal with. Uh, but anyway, you can switch the security feed using the click of our standardized mouse that the company put out. <laughs> That's one way to describe it. It's really old, but uh, we'll get through it. But uh, let me tell you... The power bill has been expensive with almost every damn night card. So hopefully, by limiting the power, you won't be like them. <sighs> Nevertheless, you can track the power on the secondary monitor, and for God's sakes, do not break it. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like I'm repeating myself at this point. Power is usually measured through the closable doors in your office, which can be closed at any time using the Z and X key. And you'll need to shut them as soon as something uh, uh, desirable may appear. Uh, you probably don't know what I mean, which in that case it's probably for the better. But anyway, don't leave them shut. Uh, Alright, a few more things and then I can set you on your way. We actually have a spare room next to your office, which has pretty much been deserted for some time. However, we used to allow employees to go in there, but I uh, uh, mm -hmm. kind of had an accident. Needless to say, don't ever let those curtains open all the way. And if you by chance actually see anything, or anyone back there, uh, don't go telling the media. Okay. We've had some rough edges in the past, and probably even more than I've seen myself. But, uh, long story short, always close the curtains. Don't ever ask why either. It's just a company rule. Honestly, I, <laughs> I don't even know myself. You can walk there using the W key. Oh! Um, if an animatronic, specifically a raccoon and the, the, the thing from the curtains, find their way into your office, you can't hide from them. Somehow they have increased awareness, possibly some sort of uh, developing mistake. Uh, it's best not to think about it too much. So, uh, yeah! That'll set you on your way. Close the cur- Oh, oh, wait, 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 one more thing. If two of our amazing animatronics somehow managed to, uh, find their way to both of your doors, we found a small trick for that. Hiding under the desk seems to actually help, and even save my la- I mean, uh, my job. Well, uh, it helped me save my job one time. So, uh, yeah, close the curtains, monitor the building, toggle flashlight, hide under the desk, and you'll be promoted as soon as you know it. And actually, please don't hurt yourself. We've had some issues with our reputation, and it kind of went downhill recently. Damn, pizzeria down the street. Fazbear's Pizza or something. Somehow, it's managed to absolutely destroy our reputation due to them having some sort of robot incident. Uh, after that discovery, animatronics may just be looked at in a different way. Yeah, uh, it's a bit unsanitary and rude, but customers are customers. We don't need them, we need their cash. Hello and welcome to your new job at Doug's and Rachel's. We have the best animatronics and food available at the lowest prices. Straight up guarantee. Since this is your first night at the job, Is it for the 
Hello? Uh, hi! Uh, welcome back to Doug and Rachel's and, uh, yeah, um, company didn't really want me to record any more phone calls after your first night, but I figured, why not? After all, they don't monitor the calls after the first one, so I'm safe to say whatever I want. <laughs> well, for starters, which I'm sure you know by now, the animatronics are really jumpy. Uh, the easiest way to say it is something like, performing after hours, but with a bit more of a kick. They seem to actually move around the building, and no one knows why, actually. Uh, one of the night guards tried to do some investigating himself, uh, which probably was the dumbest idea ever. Uh, poor kid. It's safe to say that it didn't end particularly well. Uh, other than that, nothing really happened recently, although I really didn't say that yet. You're a fourth or fifth, fifth night guard right now. Um, the others being in an unnatural state. One of them even stopped talking and developed some sort of verbal communication problem. Very strange. Huh? They had to take him to some therapist and the family tried to save us. Cool. Uh, despite all their efforts, of course it didn't work. Nothing ever does. All it takes is the company's little bit of money before they just wash all the troubles away. I uh, shouldn't question it, and neither should you, for the sake of our job, at least. As hellish as all this may seem, you'll get through it. Almost all of us do. Don't you think taking the endoskeletons was enough? Wait, oh shit. Up at the wrong moment. Other than that, uh, 
Welcome back to Rachel's, of course. By now, I'm sure you have to hang on things, so there's actually no point of rambling on. <laughs> I'm actually just surprised you've uh, lasted this long. I mean, with your job. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, anyways, I I've heard some news lately. Uh, nothing really interesting, of course, you know. Except the fact that the owner is missing. Weirdly. No one has seen him anywhere in the building. A bit strange. What do you think? Uh, not that I really care, just curiosity. You, know. you, uh, you wanna know the worst part? We won't get promotions without him being here. I, uh, hopefully, uh, wish he comes back. For the sake of promotion, at least. It's stupid to think of getting the promotion by now, though, interestingly enough. Probably due to the fact that the owner doesn't really want to be attached to the company or the mascots for some reason. Maybe he hates this place for whatever reason. Maybe as much as we do. <laughs> I, I know I do. In many ways that you probably not ever imagine. Oh, this place sure does have a shady past. Uh, all, all right. So I think I'm gonna call it quits now. I'll chat with you tomorrow. But see ya. Don't you think taking the endoskeletons was enough? Wait, oh shit. Uh, hello? Uh, sorry about that. Just accidentally picked up at the wrong moment. Other than that, uh, welcome back to Rachel's, of course. By now I'm sure you have to hang on things, so there's actually no point of rambling on. Uh, I'm actually just surprised you've uh, lasted this long. I mean, with your job. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, anyways, I I've heard some news lately. Uh, nothing really interesting, of course, you know, except the fact that the owner is missing, weirdly. <laughs> no one has seen him anywhere in the building. A bit strange. What do you think? Uh, not that I really care, just curiosity, you know. You, uh, you want to know the worst part? We won't get promotions without him being here. I, uh, hopefully... Don't you think taking the endoskeletons was enough? Wait, oh shit. Uh, hello? Uh, sorry about that. Just accidentally picked up at the wrong moment. Other than that, uh, welcome back to Rachel's, of course. By now I'm sure you have the hang on things, so there's actually no point of rambling on. <laughs> I'm actually just surprised you've uh, lasted this long. I mean, with your job. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, anyways, I, I've heard some news lately. Uh, nothing really interesting, of course, you know, except the fact that the owner is missing, weirdly. 
No one has seen him anywhere in the building. A bit strange. What do you think? Uh, not that I really care, just curiosity. You know. You, uh, you wanna know the worst part? We won't get promotions without him being here. I, uh, hopefully, I wish he comes back. For the sake of the promotion, at least. It's stupid to think of getting the promotion by now, though, interestingly enough. Probably due to the fact that the owner doesn't really want to be attached to the company or the mascots for some reason. Maybe he hates this place for whatever reason? Maybe as much as we do? <laughs> I, I know I do. In many ways that you would probably not ever imagine. Oh, this place sure does have a shady past. Uh, Alright, so I think I'm gonna call it quits now. I'll chat with you tomorrow. See ya.